I am Kalash Kumar and will be telling you about how to configuring the modem which we are using how to configure it to connect to the internet so first of all I am telling you that I am using Kenda model number is D151 okay so uh, the steps for all the modem are basically the same especially many of the thing doesn't change so I am going to tell you first of all uh, you required an IP address to go to to connect to the modem so the IP address is written on the back side of the modem you are using okay so I am using I am using Tinder and the modem the IP address which has been written is 192.168.1.1 okay I am hitting A and enter here it has been username and password login credentials is required so the login credential is by default is admin admin it may change for different routers uh, different modem it does change so you can get it very easily it is written on the modem back side of the modem so logging on the home page we are on the home page of the modem uh, i am using tender and i will tell you first of all what the modem uh, model number which I am using D151 of Tenda consists it is uh, DSL line which is the phone line or the Ethernet line which has been uh, installed or which has been connected here these are the four LAN wires this is the reset button this is the power cable button this is the on or off button and this slot is the antenna okay so first of all the primary setup which has been required is basically provided by the ISP you just have to write what as it is which has been provided by the ISP as I have been I have uh, the basic requirements that I am using the phone cable the link type is the phone cable and uh, the country is India ISP I am using BSNL you can change the ISP uh, if you are using the different ISP there are many of ISPs present according to the countries and the VPI and VCI is being provided by the ISP itself the connection type the username and the password so to configure or to connect to the internet first of all you have to connect the laptop or the computer by the LAN wire it is will not be show the connection first you have to configure this way or you have, if you want to configure the wireless also if you are to enable the Wi-Fi of the router it is if it has the feature of that so um, first here is the option wireless setup enable it and use the SSID SSID is basically what do you want as a uh, name to your Wi-Fi okay then I am telling you like that it is been showing BSNL which is I am connected to the Airtel which is another one so you can give the ID and the password here and just click you have to click OK okay so this is the basic requirement how to connect to an Wi-Fi or how to configure uh, how to configure a modem so in the next video I will be telling the advanced feature of the modem which is I am using the D151 tender so thank you for watching this video have a nice day